Okay, here's the sitch. Uh, that right there is a roller coaster. Can I see it in there? There's a car. Behind it is a roller coaster. Um, in French, the word for roller coaster is Montagne Russe, Russian mountain. I don't know if the mountains look that in Russia. Oh well. Um, but this, in general, is Parc Asterix. Um, I'm here with people that you're only going to see from behind for a bit. Um, Nisha, Jeremy, Megan, me. Um, and it is a uh, roller coaster day, even though you can see behind me. The weather is gray and dreary, and it's probably going to rain most of the day. Mm, we got a deal to come here today. It's like a professional's day, meaning like companies could get really, really reduced tickets, prices to come here. So we jumped on it because I've never been here before. Uh, I don't know if... Nisha, have you been to Asteris before? No, never. Never, okay. So this is a but discovery for everyone. Even if I don't do the ride, I've been... I've finally managed to... Right. Well, no, and there's no obligation to do it at the rides. Who knows if the rides are even going to be running uh, in this weather. Because apparently we've got a big-ass storm coming to us in like 20 minutes. <laughs> but it's going to be fun because we have your gun away. each other. I'm putting my gun away. Oh, look at him up at the top of his little mountain! Little cutie. So I guess I should explain. Asterix is um, is a comic book character in France. He's a a Gaulois, and he is known for being um, uh, shall we say short-tempered. And he's got this really really big friend named Obélix, who is kind of a gentle giant sort of thing. But he's at least five times the size of tiny little Asterix. Like Asterix, Obélix. Um, and they just go on misadventures and adventures and all sorts of fun. Um, and I think I read it. Have you? Did you read Asterix and Obelix like in French class? No, uh, by myself because I'm not good at it. <laughs> You're a good student. I only read what my teachers assigned me, so I don't know all of the history. But I know that they don't really like the the Romans. I remember the Romans being an enemy. Yes. Just pretty much everybody is an enemy because he just pisses everybody off. Also, it's totally Christmas settings here, so it's like Christmas music at a roller coaster park, which, <laughs> sure, and this Christmas tree has a lobster on it, and everything is perfectly logical. So this is what it looks like inside, and Nisha just very astutely noticed there's a, a mock-up of the Menken piece for some reason, and it's actually peeing. Um, yeah, this is this is where we're gonna be for the next little while. It's actually kind of charming. Dun 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 glow in the dark. Dun 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 dun. They've decided to really add to the Christmas atmosphere by forcing snow into us. Actually, Nisha looks really good in your hair. All right, Nisha just did her first ride at Asterix. How was it? It was good. Didn't like the beginning, but I survived. You survived. Yeah. And you actually had like a cute picture. Yeah, I did. I tried to smile. You tried to smile. Jeremy was like half falling out of the cart, which was a good time. <laughs> and it's it's kind of fun to do it in the rain, except it's also really cold. I think yeah, it's fine when you're moving, but when you're when uh, when we stopped just there, I thought we broke down. Yeah. <laughs> Update, we've done a couple more rides. One that shook my brain. It was like up and down and twirly and curly cue and corkscrew and I could not walk afterwards. It was a lot. Um, and then we did the spinning teacups one, which actually made me feel sicker just because of the spinning. And it is really coming down. You can't really see it in the camera, but it's raining quite a lot, so the umbrella has been deployed. Uh, and I guess now we're doing a car, which has the semblance of being covered, but I don't know if I trust it. We've taken refuge from the rain in this very spookily lit cavern? Indoor village? I... what would you... what? What is this place? Oh. Nisha, what is this place? I don't know. <laughs> I think it's the... I'm going to bring back outside. Okay. 
currently experiencing that sensation of being outside and wet and rained on and cold and then going inside and eating for a little bit and drying off and not being completely warm but warmer and then coming back outside and just being like god damn it it's not even that cold out i guess it's just it's the shock but i think we've eaten a little bit we've been really careful about not you know over gorging uh because we're about to go on some more rides i really wish i could take out a camera on the ride but it's either like adelie forbidden or uh it's in my pocket and there's no way for me to get it out so this is gonna have to suffice hey Cool. Uh, excuse me, I've been to Greece, and that's not how you spell it in Greece. So, like, um, okay. Okay, we just found a new favorite. Well, some of us have found a new favorite. <laughs> um, it's one that like goes forward like a regular roller coaster, and then at one point it just brings you backward, and you do like half the track backwards. It's terrifying. It's so much fun. And we're going again! We're going again! Bye bye! <laughs> Same <way. laughs> Bye, kiddos! Love. <laughs> <Hello>. You <laughs> remember? This ride is crazy. I can't, I can't catch my breath. This is, ah, we're gonna drop, we're gonna drop, oh my god! Etc. Actually, it is kind of fun to just spin around. This music is maddening though. Well, I can't find my camera because I buried it deep in my bag, but we're rounding out the day after over a dozen, no, over 10 rides accomplished for me. A dozen for Megan and Jeremy. Uh, we're rounding it out with the waffle. What it, how is it? Oh, good. Oh. It's dubby. Oh, and it took like forever to make too. Yeah. Well, that's disappointing.